The ice and the breaker, two words that called an icebreaker. It's a special purpose vessel designed to move and navigate through ice-covered waters, creating safe waterways for other boats and ships. It is equipped with a strengthened hull, an ice-clearing shape, and powerful engines to push through sea ice. These ships are used to escort convoys, free immobilized ships by breaking the surrounding ice, and open safe passages through ice fields. They are also employed for scientific research, trade, search and rescue, and Arctic cruises. Icebreakers are essential for providing access to remote areas and are designed to break through even the thickest ice thanks to their unique features and extreme power. Let's take a look. How the icebreakers sail or destroy vast chunks of ice. Icebreaker ships are designed to break through thick ice and make inhospitable paths accessible to the world, especially in the polar regions. Icebreakers clear paths by pushing straight into frozen over water or pack ice. The bending strength of sea ice is low enough that the ice breaks usually without noticeable change in the vessel's trim. In cases of very thick ice, an icebreaker can drive its bow onto the ice to break it under the weight of the ship. To do that, the hull is reinforced at the bow, the stern, and at the water line, and covered with special polymer materials to minimize friction. Sea ice has relatively low bending capabilities, so it usually breaks easily under the strengthened hull. By the way, there must be challenges in doing this, right? Navigating through ice-covered waters presents several challenges for ships. Ice is an obstacle to any vessel, even an icebreaker, and the first principle of successful ice navigation is to maintain freedom to maneuver. Once a vessel becomes trapped, it goes wherever the ice goes, and it can be challenging to break free. The longer open waterway around a difficult ice area whose limits are known is often the fastest. The presence of sea ice requires a ship to exercise caution, for example, by avoiding icebergs, slowly sailing through a lead, or by working with an icebreaker to follow a course through the ice to a destination. Additionally, ships must also deal with the extreme cold of the climate in regions such as the poles. The accumulation of ice on the superstructure is a dangerous phenomenon, and ships must be equipped with proper equipment to remove or prevent ice and snow accretion from the escape routes. To avoid mishaps during ice navigation, icebreakers are normally provided for commercial vessel operations, which help to ensure safe navigation. The Russian Navy operates several icebreaker ships, including the Ivan Papanin and the Yevpati Kolovrat. These vessels are designed to assist warships through rough icy waters and are equipped with powerful engines and reinforced hulls to navigate through ice-covered areas. The Ivan Papanin is the first vessel built to the Project 23550 design, while the Yevpati Kolovrat is built to the Project 21180M design. These icebreakers play a crucial role in ensuring safe navigation in the Arctic and other icy waters, supporting Russia's naval operations in these challenging environment. But on the other side, the United States Navy does not have any icebreaker ships in its inventory, while the United States Coast Guard has two aging icebreakers. The U.S. Arctic Security Affairs Advisors recommend acquiring new icebreaker ships for the Arctic, where the ice is melting year by year and forming new waterways.